Good evening, class. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hello, everybody. What's cooking? Hi, teacher. Ya bien escuchar ese saludo. What's cooking? No? No. Es un WhatsApp? ¿Cómo así WhatsApp? ¿Qué onda? What's, hey, what's cooking? ¿Qué traman? ¿Qué hacen? ¿Qué onda? No es que, ¿qué estás cocinando? Literalmente sería que estás cocinando, pero entre amigos le fue, what's cooking? All right. All right, let's, let's, let's start, okay? Are you ready? Yes, ready, yes. Are you ready to rock and roll tonight? Yeah. Okay. Uh, nah, rock and roll. All right, let's, let's start, let's start. Let's do it. And this is a reading. What's in a name? Look at the names in the article. Do you know any people with these names? You see the names? George, Jacob, Michael, Stanley, Betty, Emily, Jane, and Nicole. Do you know people like that with those names? Yeah? What are they like? What are they like? Como son? You know a George? I I have two friends that are, their names are George, but they're they were they were extrovert. Extrovert, hardworking, a little crazy. And I have a friend that his name is Stanley. Uh also, he's he's nerdy, but he's uh, he's friendly and smart. Okay, van a leer. You're going to read. Lucia, hello, Lucia. Hello, teacher. How are you, Lucia? How are you? I'm fine. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, read the first paragraph. Okay. When I, when I say stop, you stop. Okay, start. Oh, all, oh, okay. Okay, here under this, say, your name is? Your name is very important. Uh -huh. When you think of yourself, you probably think of your name first. It is an important part Part of your identity. 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 Okay. Identity. identity. Thank you. Stop. Daisy, okay. continue. Right now, the two most popular names for babies in the United States are Jacob for the boys and Emily for girls. Why are these names popular? And why are some names unpopular? Unpopular. Thank you. Stop. Okay. Sulma, continue. Okay. Names can become. Uh, 
Nate become Nate can become superior because a famous actor. Mm -hmm. TV or what characteristic or athletes. Athlete. Superior name suggests very positive, positive thing. On popular name suggests negative thing. Sur surprisingly, 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 people generally early on the way they feel about name. Here are some common opinions about name. From a recent survey. Survey. Stop. Thank you. Elba, continue. Boys' names, girls' names. George, average, boring. Jacob, creative and friendly. Michael, good looking, athletic. Stanley, nerdy, serious. Your names, very old fashioned. Mm -hmm. average, Emily, independent, and um, adventurous, Jane, plain, ordinary, Nicole, beautiful, intelligent. Thank you. Stop. Uh, let me see. Selena, Jamilet. So why do parents? give their children unpopular names. The biggest reason in tradition, many people are named after a family member, of course. Opinions can change over time. A name that is unpopular now may become popular in the future. That's good news for the George and Betty's out there. All right, out there. Thank you. Let's continue reading. Freddy, start with your name is very important. Your name is very important when you think of yourself. You probably think of the name first. It is an important part of your identity. ¿Cómo se dice la última? No. Identity. I, identity. Ide identity. Ide identity. Okay. Daisy, continue. Daisy, well, perdón, perdón. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. O ya había pasado, Daisy. Ya leí es oh. específicamente ese oh. texto, ya lo leí oh, por pues, el siguiente. Okay. okay, no, no. De Omar... Uh, the opportunity to Estela. Right now, the two most popular names for babies in the United States are Jack for boys and Emily for her. Why are their names popular and why are some names unpopular? All right, thank you. Stop. Thank you. Sandy. Continue. Names can become become popular because of actors, TV characters, uh -huh. or I I sleep. Uh, uh, athletes. I I sleep. Athletes. Popular names. It is very positive. The popular name to the negative surface. People generally agree on the ways they feel. Here, here are, are some common opinions about names from our recent. Survey. Okay, thank you. Stop. Rosibel. Boys name, girls names. Que, que le bajen, que le bajen al perreo ahí, por favor. Okay. 
Thank you. <laughs> Boys name George Average Boring Hako Creative Friendly Michelle Good Good Looking Athletic Stanley Dirty Serious Here's Nay Betty Old Fashion Avarash Emily Independent Adventure Jump Line Ordinary Nicole Beautiful Intelligent all right, thank you. And we finish with uh, Wendy Adamaris. So, why do parents give their children a popular name? The biggest reason in tradition, many people are named after a family member. Of course, opinions can change over time. A name that is unpopular now make it become popular in the future. That's good news for all the judges and very out there. All right. Thank you. Your name is very important when you think of yourself. You probably think of your name first. It is an important part of your identity. Right now, the two most popular names for babies in the United States are Jacob for boys and Emily for girls. Why are these names popular? And why are some names unpopular? Names can become popular because of famous actors, TV or book characters, or athletes. Popular names suggest very positive things. Unpopular names suggest negative things. Surprisingly, people generally agree on the way they feel about names. Here are some common opinions about names. From a recent survey, boys' names, George, average, boring, Jacob, creative, friendly, Michael, good-looking, athletic, Stanley, nerdy, serious, girls' names, Betty, old-fashioned, average, Emily, independent, Adventurous, Jane, plain, or ordinary, Nicole, beautiful, intelligent. So why do parents give their children unpopular names? The biggest reason is tradition. Many people are named after a family member. Of course, opinion can change over time. A name that is unpopular now might become popular in the future. That's good news for all the Georges and Bettys out there. Right? Let's continue. You're going to work See where are where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Here.
and the activity is this one. You're, go, you're going to read the article, then check the statements that are true. And then exercise B according to the article, which name suggests positive things and which suggests negative things. Complete the chart. And the last, the last one, what names are popular in El Salvador? And why are they popular? Teacher. Hello. Teacher, um, please send the presentation. Yeah. Sorry. I did. Okay. Okay, Thank let's you. go, let's go to the rooms. What happened, Lucia? No pude entrar. Jennifer, can you hear me? Jennifer Sarai. He observado que tiene dificultad para entrar en las, en las salas. Siempre se queda afuera.
Great. Welcome back. Okay. Um, number one, your name is part of your identity. True or false? Is that true? True. 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 Okay. True. People, number two, people often feel the same way about a particular name. True. 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 Boys' names are more popular than girls' names? False. 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 Uh, four, people are often named after family members? True. That is true. true. That is true. 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 My, my, I, I'm, I'm, I'm named after my father. My father's name is Victor and I'm Victor. Okay. Uh, five, opinions about names can change? True. 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 Okay. According to the exercise B, according to the article, which name suggests positive things and which suggests negative things? Positive names. Jacob and Jacob. Michael. Jacob. Michael. 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 Emily. 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 Nicole. 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 Okay. Negative names. George, Betty, 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 and Jay. Okay, Betty, Betty, Betty. Okay, thank you. What names are popular in El Salvador? Najib. Jose, <laughs> Maria, Antonio, Brian, Pedro, Pablo, Chucho, Jacinto, José. José. <laughs> Los de este, de Antonio. Yo lo googleé, teacher. Oh, oh, oh. En el país. Can, can you repeat, please? José, María, Antonio, and Elizabeth. And Elizabeth. Yeah, my, 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 big, my big sister is Elizabeth. Yeah, okay. José, Antonio, María, and Elizabeth. Okay, thank you. Let's continue with another activity. How do you spend your day? Things that you do. Okay. How do you spend your day? The six worst jobs in the United States based on salary, stress, number of hours, working conditions, and security. From bad to the worst. Got it? Desde el más malo hasta el peor. Fisherman. Taxi driver. Cowboy. Construction worker. Dancer. And lumberjack. Understand? Yep. How'd you say lumberjack? Yes. Lumberjack. Lumberjack. A lumberjack is un talador de árboles. Ajá, eso veo, pero quería saber bien en sí que era. Ah, Portador. okay. Sí, sí, es. Es un lumberjack. Lumber. It's dangerous. Okay. It's dangerous job. Dangerous. Yeah. Yo no sabía, o sea, construction worker es como albañil. Yep. In no, no sabía que así se decía. But in, in general, también puedes decir Mason. De veras. Sí. Hay... ¿Cómo se escribe eso? Mason. Ajá. Uh -huh. M-A-S-O-N. Ah, yeah. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Construction in, in the United States is, uh, es todo, ¿verdad? Incluyendo armado de casa, uh -huh. piso. Everything. Todo, todo. Construction worker. Okay, let's go. Yes, cowboy. Cowboy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> cowboy. Gracias. Pero en realidad, o sea, ¿qué hacen? 
no no it is is uh, a cowboy uh, take care of the cows of course ¿verdad? ganado but they have an infinity of cosas yeah como granjero cowboy correcto correcto como un granjero right Colectan paja para el ganado, ven, eh, eh, bueno, casi, cuando casi sea cowboy, ganado. cuando yo sea cowboy voy a describirlo mejor. Okay. But right now, I'm no, I, don't, I just know a little bit. Ok, let's continue. I want you to work, I want you to complete the word mat with jobs from the list. We have cashier, chef, company director, dancer, flight attendant, musician, pilot, receptionist, server, singer, tour guide, and website designer. Okay, and the four categories we have office work, travel industry, food service, entertainment business. We have an example for each one. You do the rest, okay? Do it individually. Hello? Okay, is your finish? Okay. Finish, Peter. Okay, wait, wait for the rest.
field. Okay, I got finish. Elba finish. Lucia. No teacher. Not, not yet. Ever, no. ever. Finish. Finish. Maria Jose. Finish. Finish. Okay. Selena Quintanilla. Selena Yamilet. Are you finished? <laughs> Dígame ya mi mejor. <laughs> como la flor, como la flor. <laughs> Finish? No. No, ya. Yeah. Okay. Rosibel? No. Um, Sandy? Finish? No. No. Zulma? Are you finished? No. No, okay. Daisy Stefania. Yes. yes. Freddy. Finish. All right. Emily. Yes. Thank you. Eric. No. Okay. Stella. No. Jennifer. No. Diana, Jan Miller. Fatima. Finish. Thank you. Margarita. Thank you. Pablo Alejandro. I finished, teacher. Thank you. Erika. Finish t-shirt. Thank you. Andrea. Finish. Okay. One more minute. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, tell me. How to pronounce the word, but the job uh, before website designer? Tour guide. Guide. Tour guide. Okay, thank you. All right. Okay, let's check. What do you have for office work? Receptionist. Receptionist. Website designer. Website designer. Company director. Company director. Yes. Thank okay, you. thank you. And we can add secretary, right? Secretary. Yes. Uh, all right. A clerk. A concierge. No, no. Clerk. A clerk. Yeah. Um, Cloud. No. Cloud. A cashier, maybe. No, no cashier. No, no. No wait, cashier. Wait. No. no cashier. No. Okay. For um, the, the security guard. Ah, uh, security guard. Yeah. 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 Yes. Travel industry. Store pay. Store. 
Pilot. 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 Yes. Yeah. Of my attendant. Yes. My attendant and tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Yes. Food service. Chef. Chef. Uh huh. Oh. Hello. Cashier. Server. Cashier. Teacher. Maybe a cashier. Server. Yeah. All right. Entertainment business. Musician. Singer. 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 Actor. Actor. Yes, actor. Yes. Actor. I serve music. A clown. Popolito. Okay, here we have office work, office manager, accountant, an accountant, secretary. Okay, and in the travel industry, you can ask, you can add a bellboy. You know what is a bellboy? What's a bellboy? No. El, 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 el maletero, el, how do you say? Botones. Uh, okay. A, tra a translator. A driver. In food, in food service. Wait, we have a host. Yeah. A waiter. A, bar, a, bar, a bartender. Bar, bartender. Yeah. In entertainment, we have actor, actress, fashionist, singer, clown, Hello. pero singer ya está. De esos son los que no están. Clown, ah, okay. clown, makeup artist, maquillista. Got it? Got it. Good. Let's continue. All right. This is work and workplaces. Look at the picture, match the information in columns A, B, and C. So it's like, like a snake, yeah? You start on A, continue on B, and finish on C. Example, a salesperson sells clothes in a department store. Continue with the rest, please. Chef. Chef, food. food. In a restaurant. Yes. Oh. Take note. A flight attendant sells passengers for an airline. Hmm. Do it order order the sentences. Okay, but you have to do it on our books? Or... Yeah, on your, on your notebook. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, on your notebook. Like a good student. So you're good students.
Here the person. Ready? Yes. Okay, a chef? No. Chef cooks food, food, food in a restaurant. restaurant. Cooks food in a restaurant, yes. A fly attendant? Company. Okay, serves. Company. Serves. Serves passengers. Serves passengers for an airline. Yes. A carpenter. A carpenter. Company. For a construction company. Yes. Yes. A receptionist. In an office. In an office. In an office. In an office. Así corridito, así corridito. A nurse. Very good. Very good. Now let's let's work on another exercise. Okay. We're talking about picture number one, okay? In picture number one, we have a salesperson and it's a, it's a girl. Yes, it's so really we're going to use she, right? She's a salesperson. Yes. She sells clothes yes, right. and yes. she works in a department store. Got it? Okay, number two. Como the elsewhere. He's a chef. He's a chef. He cooks food. He cooks food. In a restaurant. Restaurant. He works. He works. He works, he works in, works in a restaurant. restaurant. Okay. With the fly attendant. The fly attendant. She's a. Is he or she? He. he. It's a he, he, right? You can see he. the mustache. He. Yeah, it's a he. So, he's a fly attendant. And he, he serves, he serves passengers. passengers. He works, he works for, for, an, an, for, an, an, for an airline. For, for an, for an for airline. An for an airline. 
Pretty good. Okay. A carpenter. She is a carpenter. Uh -huh. She is a carpenter. She, she builds, builds houses. Yes. She works. She works for a construction she company. Construction uh, company. For a construction company. No construction. 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 No construction. No, no, no. No, no, es, es español. Construction. 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 All right. Construction. Yeah. A receptionist. She answers the phone. Uh huh. And she works in an office. He works. In an office. Yeah, he, he works in an office. He works in an office. Okay, number six. She's a nurse. She's a nurse. She cares for patients. And she works in a hospital. She works in a hospital. Pretty good, pretty good. That was pretty good. Say, how do you say part, patients? Parents? Patient, patient. 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 Okay. Thanks. Patient like... Just a little patient, yeah, yeah. Patient. Patient. Oh, okay. Patient. A little patient, yeah, yeah. Patient. Okay. okay, let me see. Sulma, you wanna practice with me this conversation? Okay. Okay, I'm Jason. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Conan Tech Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I am a year. I take people on tour to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a, in a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay. Perfect, Zulma, thank you. Okay. All right, this is the last activity. And we're gonna call the attendance. Okay, Wendy, I understand. Let's call the attendance and then we go party. Ooh. <laughs> no, tomorrow is party and not today. Tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow is Friday. Yeah, tomorrow is Friday. No classes tomorrow, okay? Yeah. Andrea de Los Angeles. Present. Thank you. Brenda Carolina Mejia. Present, teacher. Thank you. Daniela Beatriz Cerritos. Now, Daniela. David Moises Ventura. No, David. Daisy Estefania Carrillo. Present. Thank you. Diana Yanile Alas. Yes, yes. Thank you. Dina Esmeralda Ortiz. No, Dina. Eved Jaciel Cardoza. Sí, I am. Thank you. <laughs> Elba Isabel Zúñiga. Present teacher. Thank you. Emily Nicole Ramírez. Present. Thank you. Eric Ronaldo Rosales. Present. Thank you. Erika Marilu Estrada. Present teacher. Thank you. Stella Guadalupe Maravilla. Present. Thank you. Fátima Larisa Melara. I am here. Thank you. 
Freddy Ernesto Gutiérrez. Okay. Jennifer Saraí Vigil. Present. Thank you. Julia Margarita Rivas. Thank you. Lucía del Carmen Mejía. Present. Thank you. Present. Thank you. María José Cucufate. I'm not here. Thank you. Marvin Alexander Ramírez. Pablo Alejandro Vázquez. I'm here. Thank you. Roberto Carlos Perdomo. No, Roberto. Rosibel Esmeralda Laínez. Thank you. Sandy Roxana Díaz. Thank you. Selena del Carmen Pérez. Vanessa Elizabeth Medina. Wendy Adamaris Peites. Present. Thank you. Selena Yamilet Reyes. Present. Thank you. And Zulma Natividad Alvarado. I'm here. All right. Thank you. Okay, my friends. We are finishing the first week. Como ven, como vuela el tiempo, ¿verdad? Ya se nos fue una semana. Okay. I hope you're starting, porque usted tiene que hacer la diferencia. Una hora no es suficiente, usted ya lo sabe. Tiene que estudiar por su por su propio lado, ok, así que sean autodidactas exploten el internet y siempre coman platos típicos ok Good. All right. Thank you. unos negaditos ahí sabrosos All right. so have a nice weekend and see you on Monday, bye 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 bye